Leo, what's up, my G? Welcome to my channel. I'm Entrepreneur Not Tarot. My name is Cock Frost, but you could call me the Ghetto Nun. So, Leo, I'm here to do your. Well, yes, you got the second highest view video after Libra. So, thank you, Leo. But yes, I'm here to do your June uh, bonus slash general slash love reading, my G. I do custom my readings and give no fucks about it. So, if you do, please get the fuck on. I do start all of my cards upright in my deck. I don't believe in starting out with reversals because that's some bullshit. Also, I did pre-shuffle Leo, but I did not lay any cards down just yet. We're going to do it together. Please keep in mind this may or may not resonate with every single Leo. Getting no fit nuts. Info for private readings will be below the video. Please take the time to check out our community board. It's like the farmer's market for all the nuns and high priests where they have their businesses, purposes, gift, as, gifts, etc., etc. posted. If you'd like to submit your business for the bulletin board, please check the info in the description box below the video. If you find that the convent is not for you, please look for the nearest exit mark. Get the fuck on. Watch your hand on the way. I'll hit that link. You'll be back in Thailand. Thank you to everyone for all the bookings, donations, likes, subscribes, comments, shares, purchases to my website, and pledges to my Patreon. I love you, Ty. Leo, it's been a long day, my G. You the last thing I have to do on the to-do list today, okay? Something about a Sagittarius ancestor or a Sagittarius in a home, okay, with an ancestor, they can feel them around, or you, Leo, or some shit like that. It feels like a, a passed over loved one, uh, Leo, that you could be feeling right now, okay? Or a Capricorn, this person you could be cross watcher or this person that passed away could be a Leo, Sagittarius, or a Capricorn, or a Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Capricorn, yeah, Taurus, Virgo, excuse me. Uh, this could be a man, a nice man. Some of y'all said daddy, a father, uncle, cousin, brother, something like that, grandfather. This person enjoyed the holidays, like being around family for the holidays. Whoever this ancestor is, Leo, that's around you. Christmas could have been their favorite time, or this is when they were born. Yeah. Or you were, or a cross watcher, you could have been born during this time, and this ancestor is a Leo. There's also a, a demonic spirit in someone's home as well, uh, Leo, okay? It's not who someone thinks it is. Somebody's being tricked by a, a trickster spirit. They think it's a man. So the man I described, when I was like, oh, somebody's ancestor is around. This person loved the holidays, loved the family, boo, 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 right? Somebody thinks that's who this is in their home, and it's not. Even though I just told you, Leo, that for some of y'all it is, for somebody else it's not. It's like a trickster spirit. It's not the real person's spirit. It's like some demon or some shit like that for somebody here, okay? Yeah. Ooh. Somebody can feel something or something in their home. I can't tell if it's good or bad, Leo. Well, I can. It's both. But I can't tell. When I say I can't tell if it's good or bad, meaning for you. Meaning I, I, it's too many of y'all watching. So I don't know. It could, you could be like, no, that's my daddy and them. You know what I mean? And it's good when they come through. Somebody else is like, it ain't good when they come through or they think they picking up on their daddy and it's not. Something weird like that. Okay? Give me some messages for Leo in June here, please. Yeah, this tripping, and it ain't in a good way. I, honestly, it wouldn't be a good in either way, but at least this would be tripping going north. You know what I mean? So it's like, damn, I ran all that happened, and it was like for a reason. I see why all that bullshit happened. It ended up well. This somebody that did a bunch of bullshit for it to end up very bad, okay, is what this is, Leo. So somebody was tripping, okay, when they did some shit or got involved in some shit, and it got worse. So, when you know, when I was picking up on that bad spirit, it's like somebody playing in spell work and shit, and they think they talking to their loved one, and they talking to a whole demon out here. South, no, not a motherfucker hunting them, won't leave the house and all this other shit, okay? Using that as an example, okay? That's what this shit is. But somebody thought they knew what they were doing or what they were playing with. Somebody out here is weighing over their head, Leo, okay? You were someone else. Somebody wants to sweep something under the rug now, but it's coming out. Whatever somebody was trying to hide, it's coming out, Leo. You see that rug lifting up? And it ain't good shit that somebody was trying to sweep under the rug, which it never really is, right? If it's being swept under the rug, it's never really probably a good thing. But yeah, somebody's uh, dirt is coming up, okay? Somebody could just be cleaning their carpet. Or you telling people, man, take your shoes off when you come in my house. Okay? Says Leo, our cross watcher. Yeah, you don't allow shoes in your wearing shoes in the home. Give me another one for Leo here. This is my disciple card. 
Uh, that's my Pisces card as well. Discipline. Yeah, so somebody out here acting like they a goody two shoes, uh, Leo, is what this is. And shit coming all up about a motherfucker. Okay? It's like a deacon in the church and shit. Okay? That's what this is. Uh, and now somebody's like, uh, talking about, it's like somebody saying, my past is behind me. I let my past go and all this other shit. I don't want to talk about my past. Yeah, but this could be somebody who has a heal from the past or they haven't repented for the past or they thought they didn't have to receive karma or pay consequences for the past. This somebody thought they could just put some shit under a rug and move on and then act like they just a good, righteous person. Nah, something's coming up about somebody here, Leo, and they're going to be very disappointed and embarrassed here in June. Whoever this is. I don't know why this is happening to this person. Maybe because somebody want to act holier than thou. You know? Is what this is. And somebody ain't even repented for their sins. Confess their sins or nothing. They put them all under this rug. And now they want to come out and act like they're, you know what I mean? A Christian or whatever this is somebody was trying to do. Or dabble in spirituality. And somebody got too many demons to be dabbling in shit like that. Or, or dealing with shit like that. Somebody opened up Pandora's box out here, uh, Leo. Or they, no, they already opened it. And now they want to close it. But it's too late. This shit, they didn't already look. It just, it, you know, you ain't even got to really open the whole box of Pandora shit. You just got to just lift up a little and all that shit come out. It like forced the lid of the box open is what somebody did. So it could be, Leo, that somebody came over there fucking with you. Or you went over around fucking with somebody and shit. And as soon as you did that shit or as soon as they did that shit to you, a whole bunch of problems started happening. A whole lot of shitload of energy started, uh, you know what I mean? Like, uh shifting where someone's demons started to rise and shit someone's skeleton started to come out of someone's closet when they came over there fucking with you acting like they were holier than you or better than you that's what fucked they shit up Ooh, and now look at them why 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 bitch i'm the baby yeah something about a father and a son you could have two sons leo or someone could have two sons somebody disappointed in one of them though a father is disappointed in one of his sons. Okay? I don't know which one. Maybe somebody tried to hide that shit. Like, this like could be like a dad or a mom that's like, no, I love both my kids the same. I don't have a favorite and shit. But something start coming up that apparently he or she does have a favorite. This like this type of shit. Okay? But that didn't start happening until that person started trying to tell somebody else how to parent their children. Okay? The same person who claimed, oh, no, I don't have favorite kids and my son, I don't pick one son or one daughter over the other, right? You shouldn't do that, says this person to another mom or father. You shouldn't do that. You should get make up. This is like a hypocrite. That's what this is, Leo. This is a fucking hypocrite about to get that motherfucking word, G. Yes. It's a hypocrite skeleton coming out of the closet, G, in June. Yes. This could be somebody that be all up in the church and or trying to call themselves a healer, a psychic, intuitive. They work for the people. Uh, community uh, activists, um, whatever the fuck, yeah, and they a dirty, grimy motherfucker, whoever this is. Ooh, wee. this like the preacher with that real nice Cadillac and all that jewelry on, okay? Ooh, wee. put something on the um, this what's coming up out the rug? That's what I want to know, don't we all? Mm -hmm. Let's move on. What's coming up? Uh, what's under the rug that's coming up? Ooh. Whatever it is, God saw fit, okay, for it to be exposed for people to know. There's somebody fake-ass religion or somebody could be in, like, some witchy-poo cult or something because I woo hot or maybe somebody shit. This could be, Leo, somebody really is uh, into the, the spirituality and tarot and all this shit, and they try to hide it is what this is. So some of y'all could be tarot readers and the spirituality, right? Uh, and someone is into it as well, but they tried to hide it and then they tried to talk shit about your ass at the same time. So this could be somebody saying, I don't like that Leo's into tarot or spirituality or cross watcher or some shit. We should do this and fuck them and fuck that and shit. And then come to find out this motherfucker watch tarot and the spirituality and then all that shit. All on your dick, all on everything. And then want to act holier and then down in front of other people. This is a flip flopping motherfucker, Leo. Whoever this is about to get exposed, uh, they're getting exposed because the side that they was talking shit about, they be all up on that side, G. Okay? So some man or some woman that be talking shit about you, be all up on your page, be all up on your phone, trying to get up in your drawers, all this shit. But then they go talk shit to their friends, family, baby mama, baby daddy, you know, this type of shit. And God's like, no more of that shit. I'm about to expose that you be on Leo's dick, okay? Or Leo, you be on Crosswatcher's dick, G. Yeah, God saw fit. You got God and the disciple out here? 
So damn sure somebody out here anointed Leo, okay? You could have Taurus in your chart or Pisces, but somebody out here damn sure is anointed, okay? So I hope they wasn't fucking with an anointed one because it already says, uh, touch not my anointed and do my prophets no harm, okay? So uh, this already like a, a hard stop not to fuck with Leo right here, okay? So you hear them sirens? Okay. Somebody uh, could have a gold uh, cross chain. I mean, obviously, but that motherfucker big. Some about gold chains. Someone's hiding jewelry <clears throat> out here. Somebody gonna find it. A Taurus is hiding jewelry or hid some jewelry under a ooh, under a floor, under a rug, or hid some jewelry somewhere. Okay. So basically, they're saying somebody out here is pointing the finger at someone else, and they did the shit. So let's say somebody stole a necklace or something, Leo, right? And somebody goes and tells this Taurus or cross watcher or you, Leo, like, man, um, my necklace is missing or something is missing. They're like, yeah, I think the Pisces or I think so-and-so stole it. Who, or Le I think Leo stole it. Whoever someone is accusing of stealing something, that, that's an anointed one they accused of. They accused of doing that shit. And this the one that did it. God, like, not only are you the thief, then you have the nerve to accuse my anointed child of doing this shit. Like, I'm really about to expose your ass, says God, to whoever this is. Somebody picked the wrong one. Uh, Leo, for real, for real. It's like somebody could have just left you alone, left well enough alone, and some old shit wouldn't even be coming up. It's like shit coming up about motherfucker that don't have shit to do with today, yesterday, you, or none of this shit. This shit could have happened some shit somebody did years ago. But when somebody came over there fucking with you, or fucking with you, cross watcher, that's what made all this shit come to the surface. God ain't forgot. Ain't no statue of limitations when it comes to the most high. Okay, he ain't forgot. Now he does forgive, but he don't forget. So whoever this was was forgiven for some shit they did back in the past, Leo, right? And then they had the nerve to come over there and want to fuck with you and do some foul ass shit to you. And God, like, you over here fucking with my child, like, you ain't uh, get forgiven for some foul ass shit that you did in the past. Do you want me to let that out, says God? Because I really can. I really can. Yeah, and that's what had happened. <laughs> and that's what had happened. Or that's what's going to happen. This like somebody who should have just minded their own business and shit because they a criminal too type shit. You know, it's like a criminal trying to tell on another criminal and shit. But one criminal got away. And God, like, you should have just mind your business and, and went along and counted your, your little uh, loop and shit and got the fuck on. But now you want to come over here and fucking with my people and shit. So now I'm about to charge you for them old crimes. Yeah. Somebody, ooh, Leo. Okay. Somebody being charged for some old crimes out here. They feel like spiritual crimes too. They could be like physical like crimes, but they feel like spiritual crimes. Somebody, if they're if they're actual physical crimes, somebody been stealing from a company and hide money somewhere. Okay, if it's a physical crime or stealing from a spouse or some shit like that. Okay, or ran out on the plug type shit. You know. Mm -hmm. Wow. Pulling on the disciple card. You are a Leo, I mean, or cross watcher. Some of y'all, I mean, I can't say all, oh, but some of y'all are considered God's chosen. I mean, damn, this is the disciple card and the God card. <laughs> Hello? This is Jesus and his disciple. And then you got the God card here, Leo. So, I mean, shit, who would want to fuck with you on that type of level where taking shit or somebody who's this like uh, throwing rocks and hiding their hand, right? But they were getting away with that. God was like, I'm going to let you throw rocks and hide your hand to anybody else. But when it comes to Leo or Crosswatcher, you better not throw a rock at them or all them rocks you threw, I'm going to charge you for them past ones that I let you slide with. And somebody still threw a rock at you. It's almost like they were tempted to. So when God told Adam and Eve not to eat from the tree of knowledge and shit, they just had to fucking do it. That's who the fuck this is. And they thought God was playing when he told them not to do that shit. Somebody got warned not to fuck with you, Leo, or you got warned not to fuck with somebody and somebody wanted to touch the shit. Somebody wanted to see. And the shit, that's what's up. That's what the fuck is up. Ooh, Leo. Ooh, Lee Booski. You better get it. I see a priest on the run. So I don't know what's going on in the church with little boys and shit. I don't know what this is about. There's some type of scandal going on in the Catholic church with little kids and shit. Side note. Okay. Nuns on the run, I heard. Yeah, so some some of y'all in here don't belong in here. You're not a nun. You're a hater. <laughs> Pretty much. Yeah. 
Y'all gonna start getting affected too. Cause y'all know y'all not supposed to be in here. And God told you to stay away. And it's like you just can't do it. You know what I mean? Out of my shit is what I'm saying. Me personally, stay out of my motherfucking shit. But y'all bitches can't do it. So that's when the rug start getting lifted up and he start talking all that shit about you motherfuckers. And then y'all leave and y'all, you know, that's just what y'all do. Yeah, somebody out here is, uh, and not you, Leo, necessarily, but I'm talking about whoever up in here ain't supposed to be. That's what this is. That's why they shit get told all the time. But, uh, that's what, that's what happened. Somebody's been getting a warning or got a warning about you. They tested God. Somebody wanted to see if, just pull up a little bit. I want to see if God really bowed it. Okay. Somebody wanted to see if God was really bowed it in regards to how he feel about you, Leo, or cross watcher. Do he really love you? You know what I mean? And hell yeah. Excuse me for putting hell there, God. But you know what I mean? You know that? I mean, it's like, whoo. I mean, who would test him? There's damn sure a Taurus on the run, okay? Trying to see what people know and shit, okay? Or going around to different platforms. This could be YouTube. Somebody running around the different YouTube channels or tarot channels, fishing to see what's going on with somebody because they guilty of some shit, Leo. It's either a Pisces or a Taurus. Yeah. Put some on this uh, disciple card. Look like Judas. King of Wands. There you go, Leo, with the Nine of Cups. All right, well, you happy up in here, male or female, okay? It's like uh, shit going well for you, okay? It's like what sweater, what purse, what jean, what, whatever. What food do I eat today? Where do I go today? I feel like days are good uh, in June. Some of you guys are enjoying your summer, summer nights. It's like fishing with your kids, hanging out with your boys, with your homegirls, your family. It's ch You're chilling. Something missing, though, Libra. I mean, ooh. Somebody could have stole something from a Libra or a Libra stole something from you, Leo. I meant to say Leo, though. But this somebody taking inventory of some shit. She like, what happened to my whatever the fuck purse? Where is the other one? Like, I know I had it here. Whoever this is running stole that shit. Whoever this is running stole that shit, Leo. Okay? It could have been a, a Pisces that stole some shit. A Taurus that stole some shit. Uh, another Leo, Aries, Sagittarius that stole your shit. It's a group of people that are about to flee or run and shit because they stole some shit, Leo. Or you're part of this group of people that stole some shit and you on the run like a biatch, pretty much. Somebody's wish was to come after God and God's like, okay, well, I'm going to come after your shit then. Pretty much is what this is, okay? Oh, yeah. Somebody out here was straight stealing. Catch a liar. Uh, what is it? Scratch a liar, find a thief. Leo, so whoever this is is a liar too. So there's a Gemini involved. Not saying uh, Geminis are liars, but they show me the seven of swords and that's usually my Gemini car. But shout out to Gemini, happy birthday. No, this could have been happening to you, Gemini. We love you around here, okay? But there's damn sure a Gemini involved in this. This could be a Taurus Gemini cusper, okay? That's involved in this shit. A Pisces, a Leo Aries Sagittarius is what I'm picking up heavy, okay? Yeah, a motherfucker out here straight stealing, G. From a company, a business, somebody's home, all type of shit. Throwing the put. Look at this. I said Libra, Three of Swords. Yes, a Libra nose or a, a water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, heavy Scorpio nose. Yeah. Damn, somebody, a, a heavy drinker out here. The whole family just all just drugged and fucked up and shit. Um... Yeah, somebody's gonna go through a world of hurt out here, Leo. Okay? Somebody's, uh, sh it's shit they did in the past, though. That's coming. It has nothing to do with you, Leo. It has something to do with you because people were fucking with you or fucked with you, and that's why their past is coming up to bite them in the ass, but you're not a part of their past. So basically, you're responsible for uh, relinquishing people's past demons on them. Yes, you are Pandora's box. Wow. <coughs> or a cross watcher. I'm sorry, Leo. Or Quas Watcher, you are uh, Leo's Pandora's box. So some of y'all were purposely set somewhere. I always wonder why God put that tree in the middle of Eden. Like, why put it there if you knew that people was going to be tempted to, you know, to, to bite off of it. But maybe he was testing their loyalty, their faith. I don't know why he did it. I still don't know. But it's giving me you're that same tree, uh, Leo. You are that Pandora's box. Somebody ain't supposed to eat from you. Uh, open your box, fruit, nothing. I don't give a fuck if the serpent slithered. Satan himself slithered on that shit and offered it to Eve. What did God say? Somebody still took the apple, offered that shit. I'm telling you, Leo, somebody, uh, God forbid somebody to do something and they did that shit, G. They did that shit. Either you did that shit 
or someone else did something to you after God forbid them to do that shit, okay? God said, don't take nothing from Leo at all. Don't touch Leo. Don't take nothing from him or a cross watcher. You better not. And whoever it is that he said that to about, right? This would be you, Leo. Like, you know, you came home. You're like, something's missing or a cross watcher. Something's off. Something's missing, right? Someone came in here and took something from me, right? And God knows exactly what it was. It's the person he told not to come take your shit. Yeah, he after somebody. This is God after someone, G. Or it's a whole uh, organization. This could be a hood. It's a whole gang after somebody or some shit. Or somebody on the run from some people. Some shit. Look, Ace of Wands. Hell yeah, some men after somebody. Somebody was in the poot out here too. Mm-hmm. Trying to cast an illusion or confuse somebody and shit. Uh, a whole family or some shit. And all the family got skeletons in their closet. Everybody at the job got skeletons in their closet. And every, whoever the fuck these people are, all of them got skeletons in their closet and want to come fuck with you, Leo. You know, this somebody got dirt all on them. <laughs> wow. I, this is like somebody who uh, took God for granted. They didn't necessarily take you for granted, but they dang sure took God's mercy for granted. That, you know what I mean? Them getting away with so much bullshit in this life. You know what I mean? That they didn't really suffer any consequences. But that's all the other trees that they can eat from. You feel me? You one of them trees. Yeah, but God's like, yeah, but you can't pick it or eat from that one. I let you, you know what I mean? Rob and steal and do all that grimy ass shit you do to everybody else. Do that shit to Leo though. And we gonna have a motherfucking problem, says God. And whoop, there it is. Shaka, laka, shaka, laka. Yeah, somebody's ancestors are like tribal or African or some shit like that. Or somebody tried to call a tribe or an African or a voodoo or something. Somebody tried to do something to somebody and God forbid this motherfucker, Leo. Okay? And they dumbass still did this shit with they stupid ass. Like somebody wasn't going to pick up on it. This lady look like she know everything that's up in her shit. So you know when somebody up in your energy, Leo, you know when somebody then uh, came up in your home or when somebody lying to you, you know when somebody throwing the put, you know, all this shit. <laughs> you and God are like really tight, just so people know, okay? So he tells you a lot. You don't have to go fishing for anything. It just come to you and shit, okay? Yeah, somebody about to get powered up in this bitch. This would be kind of your energy to power up. Sonic the Hedgehog. Something about to speed up on somebody, Okay? This somebody run. Some of y'all could be in a marathon or a race. This somebody who can run real fast, or somebody's on the fucking run. Somebody out here scared. Somebody scared. Some people coming after them, or uh, and somebody is. I see somebody out here asking questions about where someone is, where they live, and all type of shit, Leo. Okay. Somebody out here can, um, somebody out here is. Well, I won't even say that. That's too much info. Yeah, but somebody need to be careful. Okay. Somebody's leaving a platform, too, because they keep getting comments from somebody. I don't know if they harassing them or are people laughing at them or some shit like that. Somebody keep getting harassed on a platform. A lot of people keep coming on there, like, leaving comments, and it's to push somebody away, to get somebody to leave or something like that, Leo. Don't leave. Shit. Or a cross watcher. Don't leave. It's, a, it's trolls out here. But these are people that scared to get their own channel and start their own, like, this type of bullshit. Okay, fuck them people. Moving on. Put some on this, um, running scared now, higher fit card. Vulture. Yeah. Ooh. Somebody fleeing a moida. Okay? Somebody fleeing a whole moida. Okay? We got Scorpio energy out here. Pisces, Taurus. Uh, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius energy out here. Okay? This is also the death of like a leader is what this is, okay? And shit coming up about this shit, okay? Or this could be a matriarch, patriarch, or somebody. Somebody that has some stature, a title or something, a uh, Leo that passed away, or a cross watcher. Some information gonna start coming out about this shit. But the reason the information starts coming out about this person's death is because people started picking at this person's dead bones and shit. It said in the Bible, um, I don't know what verse that was I read the other day. I think it was in Isaiah. And it said that um, that earth's blood will cry out to the Lord. You know what I mean? The earth, earth will earth will uh, cry out for the bloodshed or something. Or the bloodshed cries out from the earth. But the same thing happened with Cain and Abel. Uh, when Cain killed Abel and God asked Abel. 
I mean, God asked Cain, where's your brother? And he said, I don't know where he is. And God said, that's a lie. His, his blood cried out to me, G. His blood cried out to me. Yes, that's how God feels about you, Leo. Anybody does anything to you or cross watcher, I don't know. Anytime you cry, shed a tear, somebody takes something, hurt you, kill you, okay, any of that shit. Your blood, your tears, any, your, all your shit. People with that steal something from you. Your material, your content cries out to the Lord, G. Okay, that I don't belong here. I'm supposed to be with Leo, okay? It's like vengeance or something like that, okay? Something of yours is crying out, Leo, okay, uh, for like vengeance or for justice. Yes, damn. Yeah, we know what happened. Remember I said Judas, and now we got the death here of Jesus and a disciple. The only disciple we know that, I mean, they all dead now, right? But the only one that we know about that died in the Bible was Judas. Jesus died because Judas betrayed him. So that is Judas. Yeah, it's a Judas out here. It's either a Scorpio, a Taurus, uh, Pisces, um, or it's a group of people responsible for some shit, Leo. But they didn't know that your blood cries out. <laughs> okay? Damn. Ooh -wee. Yeah, it's not until they start picking at something or opening something or or harassing you, stalking you, or putting your um your they said your name on the tip of their tongue. Your name on the tip of their tongue. Not even them just speaking just ill on you. Your name on the tip of their tongue is enough to cause a fucking problem between them and the most high G or cross watcher. Damn. I like your reading, Leo, if you on the good side of this. If you on the bad side of this, it really sucks to fucking be you. Somebody get killed over material things out here. Jewelry, a purse, a car, money. That's what this is, too. And then they rob them and take everything and shit. There's people out here losing their life over money and material things and shit. Okay? Or was killed for some like type of gain or something. That's coming out in June. Okay? Ooh, there's a business that's ending too. Okay. This business owes money to whoever the fuck, the government, the state, the investors, I don't know. But this business, something's about to go out of business and people just going to disappear. It's like coming the next day and it's like this business, it's just a paper on the wall that says closed for business. Don't nobody know where they are. The chairs, the desk, everything still inside. People looking through the window like, what the fuck? They, they were just open yesterday. Yeah, not today, they not. <laughs> that shit's a fucking wrap, G. Okay? It's, it's some criminal activity going on out here, Leo. And I feel like it was cool with them doing the criminal activity. Like I said, shit, we ain't all saints. <laughs> shit, you know? Uh, for sure. But this is somebody who uh, touched on someone who's like a saint. So some sinner out here touched on a saint after God told him not to. Okay? God said it's okay for a sinner to touch on another unclean, uncleans, unrepented, right? Uh, sinner can touch on another unrepented, unclean sinner. But as soon as you start touching on my anointed ones, my prophets, my saints and shit like that, we got a fucking problem. Now I'm going to charge you for all the sinners and all the other people that you attack. Somebody out here, Leo, I'm telling you, was about to be charged for past transgressions, G. Okay, that they had gotten away with, but it wasn't until they fuck with you. Now all now they're about to be charged. I told you they said there's no statute of limitations when it comes to God. So this some shit somebody could have did when they were like hella young, 18, 19 and shit, and been just committing crime all the way up. Let's say they 32 now, and God like, yeah, I'm gonna let them get away with that shit. But don't touch Leo though. You can rob everybody else, but don't rob Leo. And that motherfucker had the nerve to rob your ass, okay? And God like, well, now I'm about to charge you for all the crimes you've been committing since you was 16. This like this type of shit, G. Oh, wow. Somebody dealing with shit they never thought they'd have to deal with again, feel again, think about again. And they didn't have to till they can't fucking with you, Leo, or till you can't fucking with somebody. Period. That, that's true. They are absolutely correct. That was the, uh, that was the contract. Somebody breached the contract here with them and God, not with you. They ate from the forbidden tree, which is you, Leo. Or you ate from the forbidden tree, which is a cross watcher or whoever. It could be a Scorpio, a Taurus, Pisces, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. Could be Cancer too in regards to a cross watcher. Somebody could be a Cancer Leo Cusper as well. Put something on this disciple card with the King of Wands and the Nine of Cups. Yeah, now it's hunting time. Told you. 
That's my hunting card. Told you, G. It's a long time coming. Iguanas move very slow, but they get to where they're going. Okay? Something is a long time coming out here, Leo. Oh, wait. I told you somebody gonna be looking for something that was stolen, hunting for it. Like, where is my shit? You gonna be going to, or somebody did. Pisces, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, uh, Scorpio went around asking people, like, do you know what happened to this? Or do you know where my shit is? Or do you know where so and so is? Or what happened and shit? And everybody, like, nah, I don't know what happened. No, I don't know what happened. And now you know this, is, but look at all these people falling off. Somebody out here, Leo, that you're going to question or cross watch or someone you're going to question about if they know something about some shit, what was alive, what was taken, what was stolen, they're going to say, no, I don't know nothing about it, and you ain't going to never see that motherfucker again, and that's how you're going to know they do something about it, and then you're going to be looking for their ass, <laughs> for real. Somebody thought they uh, got away with something because they lied in your face or someone lied in some people's face and was like, this is what, what it is, right? And it's been like that. They were good. It could have been like that for years until they fucked with you. I'm telling you, Leo, I don't know why they did that shit because they damn sure got a warning. They keep saying it's like when God told Adam and Eve, you can eat every, anything out of this garden, but do not touch this shit. Do not. So that's how I know someone got tempted to do it. By, you know, they're just temptation, right? This is like sin, right? The devil is what they say, right? Tempted Eve, right? So some sin tempted some woman to do something. Then some woman went and recruited some man, okay? But the woman had already fucked up. So yeah, the man should have known. I don't know, Leo, what they talking about, but some woman got some man mixed up in some shit and had him bite the forbidden fruit too. And now everybody getting that motherfucking work, G, okay? So whoever been recruiting, but Libra did kind of have this shit. Whoever been recruiting people to bite to bite on you, Leo, or cross watcher, and you are the forbidden fruit, the tree of knowledge, G. Oh my goodness, G. You know that's where uh, birth pains came from. That's where uh, like uh, menstrual blood came from. That's where tilling the soil, hard work, labor. Like when they did that shit, Adam and Eve did that. That's why we have all those things. That's why women cry during birth pain and, and we bleed and shit. And that's why men work so hard and all these different plagues and, and curses and shit that came up on the generation of the children. That's where that shit came from. So somebody cursed their whole family, their whole generation and shit because they wanted to bite off your tree or you wanted to bite off of someone's, off of this tree here. And so now this is gonna, this is just the way that it is, whatever is set to happen. Let me look real quick, Leo, hold on. Cause I wanna see what they say. If I can uh, find it real quick without keeping you too long. Let me see, hold on. Yeah, ooh, it says, because Adam and Eve eat, had eaten the fruit, the fruit, excuse me, off the tree of knowledge of good and evil, the Lord sent them out into the Garden of Eden, or sent them out of the Garden of Eden into the world. Their physical condition changed as a result. Eve becomes alienated. That's why men try to rule over women, they say. Yeah. She will now, she is alienated from her maternal body. She will now give birth in pain. Humans were distanced from God forever. Suffering and death enter, entered the world. Human relationships were damaged. Yeah, I'm telling you, Leo. As a result of this, somebody changed like the trajectory of their life, their kids' lives, they, their kids', kids', kids' lives, some business, some home, the fruits of the everything. All they had to do was not bite on your shit. That's all they had to do was be obedient, G. So this lets me know somebody's very prideful out here. So for some of y'all, Leo, you did this shit. But you the motherfucker ain't supposed to be up in here. So now I see why they said that. Whoever ain't supposed to be up in here, that's why you getting this talking to like that. But for the Leos on the good side, yeah, you ain't even got to worry about this shit. God heard your uh, cries. If you lost any family member, anybody died, any bloodshed, any any food came out your baby tummy, you were homeless, hungry, and it was at the result of any at the hands of any of these people after God told them not to, Man, the suffering that you went through is going to look easy compared to what's about to happen to these people, Leo. Okay? And I know whatever these people did to you, it wasn't easy to go through it. But they're telling me what you went through is a cakewalk compared to what's about to happen to these people. Why is God out here hunting and killing, G? Hello? The devil ain't out here? This God out here killing and hunting. 
Hello? Can't nobody escape that. They can run. Ain't nowhere they can even run. He done created every place they think they can hide. Remember, Adam and Eve thought they could hide from God. It says they covered themselves in leaves because they were ashamed and embarrassed and shit after they ate the shit. And he like, why y'all hide? You know I can see you. I created this garden. I created this. I created the leaves that you're covering up your little tiny balls in. What are you doing? Yeah, somebody out here is going to feel like a, a man. I'm telling you, Leo. I'm telling you. Somebody cursed a whole generation of their, like their family, G. Let me see where you are, Mosky. Where's Leo in this? Because this is intense. This you, Leo. That is literally you, the strength card. So you're coming up in your own energy. Some of y'all passed away. So I always pick up on the ones that ain't here. Some of them not here no more. They were betrayed and some of them died on death row or shit. I don't know. That's what it says. So, you know, I can't never tell if y'all are alive or not, Leo, when I do this reading because I feel like a lot of dead Leos come through and chill on this reading. Side note. So that is what this is, okay? But a lot of y'all were the betrayed one for my live Leos. Y'all were the betrayed one. They tried to fry your motherfucking ass, okay? One more. Or you tried to fry somebody. If it was you, Leo, doing this, you tried to do this to an air sign, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini, or this was just done to you, Leo. Okay, or an air sign did this to you. But I'm picking up mostly if you're responsible for this, you did this to an air sign. Libra, Aquarius, Gemini. Yes, I'm gonna put it back. I know what the fuck I'll be talking about, but that is you, Leo. Double Leo, somebody could be. Or some about two Leos. So some are good, some are not. Yeah, some into that witchy poo shit. Some of y'all not. They go that Pisces energy and shit. Somebody's secrets getting revealed too, but I told you. They said what goes up must come down. Somebody's intuition is very strong. Some of you guys could be tarot readers out here, psychics and shit. Six of Pentacles came out. Somebody could be a, a Virgo Le Leo Cusper. Yeah, or Leo Virgo Cusper. I got Taurus Capricorn out here. Some of y'all climbing the ladder to success here, Leo, or in the, pro in the process of doing so. Yeah, so you know that's why the motherfucker want to come after your ass, G. After God told him, no. Nah. Let Leo get their money. Let Crosswatcher get their money and shit. Let them flourish and thrive and, you know what I mean, do what it is I sent him, them here to do. Don't touch on them. Touch on them loser motherfuckers y'all be hanging around that don't do shit all day. Somebody like, nah, I want to touch on Leo or Crosswatcher. <sighs> okay? Yeah, judgment. Could be a Libra too. You can have Libra in your chart. Told you. Yeah, somebody got to move. Somebody losing their house. People are losing things. It says that they were kicked out of the Garden of Eden. That's what's about to happen to someone. So this bitch could be getting ready to pack her shit up. Like, damn, how many boxes I'ma need? Shit, bitch, you gonna need to sell that shit. Fuck packing it, bitch. Somebody gonna have to sell some shit. They ain't even got no fucking money. Somebody's about to be like, um... They said back at ground zero, uh, you know, like a commoner. So someone who was like uh, up there, Leo, or Crosswatcher, someone who has some rank, some title, some major blessing that God gave them, their only one fucking rule was to not fuck with you. <laughs> that was the only rule and they couldn't do the shit. And now they back with the commoners again. Shit, pretty much. And it ain't going to be good. It's like somebody who left being a commoner to get put up on like a pedestal or a throne only to go back to being a commoner again. But this time when they go back, it's worse than it was the first time. Shit, this motherfucker don't know nothing about inflation. They were living good. Whoever this is, Leo was living really good. They didn't have no problems and issues because God was blessing whoever this is. Until they what? Bit on your ass. Until they bit from your shit. You're poison to someone. Or Crosswatcher, you're poison to someone. Okay? Uh, it's on, but it's the divine light, the divine energy you have. Someone that's not of the divine light or on some evil shit cannot bite from the tree of wisdom and knowledge, G. And it already says in the Bible that they yell your name out. In the, no, what is it? Is it wisdom and knowledge? Hold on. Knowledge. The fruit of knowledge. Yeah. But they, it says in the Bible that wisdom and knowledge yell your name out in the street, right? But Adam and Eve were told not to bite from the tree. So maybe the reason God told Adam and Eve don't bite from the tree is because wisdom and knowledge is going to yell your name out anyway. Like you already know everything that's attached to this tree. So it's like, why are you taking from some shit that you already got some shit? So it's like somebody's taking more from some shit and they don't need to because they have more than you. You know, so God, like you have this whole fucking garden, you know what I mean? And I gave this person this one little bitty backyard and I told you stay out this person's backyard and you can have this whole garden. What this motherfucker do? Come and get in your backyard and forfeited they whole garden, Leo, for this shit. Okay. That's why they getting fucked up. Somebody going to be sentenced to hard labor for the rest of their fucking life, G. 
or you will, somebody will. Somebody gonna have to work and find odd jobs. They ain't got no education background, no work background, none of this shit. And have the nerve to come over here fucking with you, okay? Wow. Somebody gonna end up working in a gym. Like, you know, like some shit. Yeah, they was on demon time. Or you were, because I'm asking where you are, Leo. So some of y'all was on that demon time shit, because that's my own demon time card, okay? When Jesus cast the demon into the pigs, look at his eyes, okay? The eyes are the windows to the soul. So somebody's eyes, you can look at and just tell there's something going on with them. Somebody got some vaginal issues out here too, Leo, okay? So I don't know what, what that's about. But that could be one of the things that somebody get cursed with is vaginal issues and shit for, for biting off the forbidden tree, okay? Hello? Others of you, Leo, the ones that I fucks with and shit, uh, this is this person getting this energy back. It's like, well, shit, you bite from the tree, you get what happens when you bite from the tree. Six of Pentacles, uh, give and take. It's like, so you own demon time, you get demon time, you know, is what this is. Somebody fucked up. Somebody's initials could be VPQ, VPQ, excuse me. Somebody could be vaping a lot, like smoking a lot and shit. Somebody out here nervous and shit, like they don't know what they gonna do, Leo. But it ain't nothing they can do, G. They already broke the fucking law. So this like Adam and Eve, like, well, now where do we go? You'll figure it out. Adam and Eve figured it out, apparently, because that's how Cain and Abel came to be. And the rest of us and all this other shit came to be. So whoever this is will figure out how to survive. But it's not going to be like how it was when they were in God's good grace. Somebody has been like removed from God's good grace. And it ain't you or you, cross watcher, whoever, you know what I mean, on the divine shit. And, no, and you know what I mean, you're this tree. You know you are. You're not a, a narcissist or, you know what I mean, and putting yourself as this tree. No, you know you're that tree. Like every time somebody fuck with you, they get fucked up, Leo, right? I'm talking to you. As far as somebody uh, about to get fucked up for fucking with your tree again. It happens all the time. Or a cross watcher. Anyway, Leo, that's been your reading. Uh, yes, okay? Like I said, it may or may not have resonated with every single Leo. Still, thank you for visiting my channel. Am I tripping or not tarot? Please hit like, subscribe, share with your friends. Again, info for private readings will be below the video. You can purchase your DU gear, your life like deck, and your doll face deck at thegettonun.com. And I will talk to you later. Love you. Bye.